awesome view right here, huh? You know, we try to redo the same energy that we had in Australia. We had an awesome view then. We have an awesome view now. And uh, something that I think I might start doing for all my fights if I have the, these kinds of views. my room and uh, so far so good the energy's good I feel good my training partners feel great about the work that I put in and so we feel good ready to go this is what we love to do man I love being in this environment and we're getting ready man and this is the type of environment that I thrive in and I love being being here and, and just knowing that we're gonna we're gonna go to war in a few days and I have my my, my soldiers and my capos here helping me out man and, and, and man I this is just, I wouldn't want to be anywhere else in the world. Finito! Oh, yay! It's exciting times, you know. We've been playing this for eight plus years, you know, since uh, Israel walked into the gym. It's, it's pretty cool to see it all come to fruition. Yeah, again, like it's just the same what we're doing every night. Got to keep the body sharp and keep the mind sharp. I'd like to see that the shots are crisp and accurate. So, yeah, just trying to look for that. Hey, 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 hey. That's what I read. Well, apparently, that I had to pop on my thoughts at the workout. Appreciate that. Good boy. Good. Help. I don't have any pop in my shots, so I'm going to lose. You can't find out. <laughs> Sorry. He doesn't see it. He doesn't see any pop in my shots, but he'll find out. Israel's been training pretty hard over in uh, New Zealand. Gas limbs are no joke, so we're geared for this. It'll be a pretty exciting night and uh, we're set up for a pretty good fight. My last job was um, working for an energy company and it sucked. I was just behind a desk. It was tedious and it just killed me. It took away my soul over time. At first it was cool. I was bright eyed and bushy tailed until yeah. I realized they didn't really care about me and I was just another fucking dude, you know, off the street that they could hire. But I only ever did enough not to get fired and they only ever paid me enough to come back next week. So it was a nice little working relationship. Then September 4th, 2013, I said, I'm out and I never looked back. That was my last job. And I always remember that day because that's like my birthday. <laughs> okay, I, hey, I knew I smelled Louisiana hey, chicken Max. somewhere. Ooh, this is, this is some ninja <laughs> shit. This is some ninja shit. This is not good. That's why you, that's why you 40 years old. That is not, that that's is why not you 40 good. years old. Hey champ, that is <laughs> not good. Hey, that is not good. The number one pump and bomb fight is Please, gonna happen right Emma. here. Don't hurt him. See, this is your time. This is your time. You gotta you got love it. Damn. All right, I got a pair of <laughs> I'm going to fight his ass. How are you, my man? All right, gentlemen. Hey. As soon as they told me uh, there was a fight opening for this interim title fight against Israel on April 13th, I was like, whoa, 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 whoa. That's my day. April 13, 2013 is when I won the Ultimate Fighter for the people that I don't know at home. And uh, it's a very special day. It's, it's a day that changed my life forever. And it only makes sense to uh, seal that circle on, on that day, man, and, and get that world title around my waist on that same day. I know how to use my reach very well. I've used it my whole career. And what he does, I've seen so many times. Face forward, you too. My whole UFC career, um, everyone's tried to take me down at some point. I stuffed the takedown, put their head, boom, put my balls on the back of their head, <laughs> sprawl, flat out, and then I get back up and fuck them up. I have the same fight IQ, the same cardio I can push with him. I'm a heavier puncher. I can wrestle. I think I'm better than him in jiu-jitsu. And my boxing is, is as good, if not better, than his. I just have more ways to win this fight. What's up, man? How you doing? Oh, man, you doing yeah. Because of the technique level and the uh, toughness of Max and the technique level we're both going to bring, I think we're going to get fight of the night. And uh, it's going to be another one for the history books. It's going to be a lot of volume. Volume and violence. Tough, tough. 55 excites me for sure. You know, there's a lot of the guys considered the pound-for-pound fighters in the world. 
a bunch of them is in 55, you know, and I felt like I fit in here. And this is where you gotta do, you know, if, if this is where I gotta be the number one Pablo fighter, let's go. You know, if I gotta go up a weight class, two, three, four, five, keep saying, you know, my man Daniels, DC, you know, if he's the number one guy, if, if they send his name in a contract, I'll be like, I love you, DC, but I'm gonna sign that contract. How about that for your stepmom screensaver? How about that? Weight cut is not easy. It, it never is. Even at 55, I know people say, but you made 45, you can do 55. It's not easy. I'm, I'm not a small guy, but I accept the challenge, and I'm excited to hit 155 pounds championship weight. I'm excited to fight Max. So I just embrace it. amazing material to work with with Max. He's kind of a once in a lifetime type of guy. You know, we've been doing this for a long time and I still haven't come across another guy that's quite like him. You know, not a, not my long shot. You learn things very, very quickly, but he's also able to apply it extremely quickly, you know, so he can follow directions, but he's also at a level where he can process things so quickly, he can make adjustments on the fly whether by us or just autonomous on his own, you know, so can't take too much credit for that. <laughs> I'm excited, man. I can't wait, you know, it's here. Tonight is probably the hardest work of the week is just cutting weight, you know, getting the weight down. The cut is going to be great, you know, 55, 10 pounds bigger than uh, what home usually is. And cutting weight is cutting weight, you know. I'm just glad that I get 10 more pounds and get the job done. All the talking and stuff is coming to an end, and we get to see each other at the end of the day. So, two more sleeps, and it's go time. It's fun time. It's over.